Kevin, how close is he to coming back? I've read November, but is, is he on track to come back, Kevin, in November? Uh, yeah, he's uh, making the last steps. He's start to training, I think, in the next days with uh, part of the training session with us. So everything is going well. And Mendy? Mendy, always the same process. He's going well. A lot of headlines this week generated by uh, young Phil. Um, just wondered if is he edging nearer a start in the Premier League because he's he's had a lot of substitute appearances but never actually made a start for you yet. How, how close is he to a, a Premier League start? It's not important if he's a star or some minutes or a lot of minutes or a lot of few minutes. So it's part of the the group, the squad. It's about my decisions. He's ready to play. Of course, he can start in any competition, in any games. He's ready. After that, you know, has to compete with uh, another his teammate and. Sometimes it's not possible, but he's ready. There's been talk of, of talks about a, a new contract. Are, are you across that? How, how close is he to? I don't know. I, I didn't speak about that with Chicky. I don't know. How keen are you, though, that he does sign a new deal and, and remains a really important part of your squad? Well, I think I think Phil likes to would like. Or I think likes to be here, and the club is no doubt about that. The manager is no doubt about that. So hopefully, it's going to happen sooner or later. And but I'm not involved never in this kind of situations. What are his long-term prospects as far as you're concerned? From Phil, step by step. So don't read too much, don't watch too much, train in as good as possible, play good as possible, and, and after the career, and will speak from, from himself. So he's a young players, 89 players, he has to make his own career, and step by step. So. Football is up and downs a lot, good moments, bad moments, and be stable is so important. Start from every day to be what you have to do, especially for the young players. You're playing Brighton, and Chris Hewton this week has, has been talking very glowingly about your influence on English football and talking about how you've you've had an impact on young coaches. Were you aware of that? I am only concerned to be some impact with my players. It's only I because I work with them, so I'm not, I didn't come here, I said many times, I didn't come here to change anything. So I tried to do my best, like all the managers around the world, and especially here in the Premier League. What I want is to convince the players, my players, like we were together every single day. That is the only we can we can do. It would be huge presum to us to think about, I have to change a country like has a, his amazing history about his own way in the football. That's not my pretension, not at all. So it's just to, to do my job as well as possible and especially to be influenced and the players to to know, to 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 feel the way we wanna play is a, is, is good, is the right way. Pep. Yeah. Uh, you've got these these games coming up against Liverpool the week after. Obviously the Hoffenheim is a, a big game. Is it easy to keep the players focused on this Brighton game? Uh, of course. If they want to play with Hoffenheim and Liverpool in the future, they have to play every single day as best as possible. So now it's Brighton, of course. I know what, what they have done uh, against United at home. And when we play in Anfield, they were so close to, to get points there. They played so good in the second half. I watched the game. So it's a good side, really good side and good manager. And they are together for a long time. It was in the championship in the Premier League, three, four season. They know exactly what they have to do. And uh, Mora is in a top form. Nockhart is a, an amazing a winger. So they are really well organized in the back four, all the movements they have to do. So it will be a really tough game. And uh, that is what it is. So we know that and we're going to try to do our game because the best way to face Hoffenheim and Liverpool and the future is always playing the, the present game. Pep, are you, um, are you happy with Mendy at the moment? Are you happy with his progress and demeanour around the club and how he's progressing? Mendy? Yeah. You happy with him? I, have, I was uh, injured six months, seven months last season. No, now I'm just asking, has, has he been around the club this week for treatment? Now he's injured again. Every day is in the training session with the treatment, yeah. And you're happy with how he's progressing? The treatment? With how Mendy's progressing <laughs> with the treatment? Physio no, no, no. There was a, there's been a suggestion that he was late for, tra for treatment on Sunday and that you were unhappy with him, so 
was he late for treatment on Sunday? Are, are you unhappy with him? Are you... Arrived late, yeah. Arrived yeah. late, yeah. And that sometimes happens. In the last period, a lot of players arrive late for the traffic. Manchester is under construction. What, on a Sunday? All, all the city. And most of the players arrive late and they have to drop the kids to the school and sometimes arrive late. But, but, but I'm, I'm talking about Sunday, so there's no schools on a Sunday. It's just, it was at the boxing on Saturday night in London, so. Was that an issue that it was at the box and he turned up late for treatment and it and it's been it's annoyed you a little bit? They should be here. Yeah. He knows it. Yeah. So has he been made aware that you're not happy with him? I spoke with him, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, and when do you expect him back? When he's fit with the, when he's fit with his feet. Yeah. But do you think he'll be fit quicker if he gets to training on time and treatment on time? No, it depends on fit. now he's injured. So yeah. Mendy is not a big problem about physical condition, he's quick. The problem is he was injured, he's still injured, and when he's okay, he's coming back, and after when he decides to play, he's going to play.